What's happening YouTube? It's your dude Heat Ledger. I'm back at you guys again with a brand new sneaker unboxing. Today it's a trade that I did with my friend Will out in Connecticut. Will and I have done a couple trades before. This time I sent him my Black Tongue Fire at Fives plus some trainers and he sent me this shoe from 2015. This shoe to me is a grail because as a kid when I saw this shoe I was like wow that's an amazing shoe I don't know what it is and then uh, back around 2007 I didn't get my hands on them and then they came out again in 2015 so some of you guys might already know what this shoe is but um, it's probably not a grail to you hence the title um, I'm just assuming because it's still at retailers now at least at some of my local retailers not all of them basically this shoe isn't doing terribly because it's not at outlets yet as far as I understand but it's also not doing amazingly because I still see it at retail stores and it's been around for several months so it's kind of in this weird gray area in my opinion and this is a really iconic shoe so it's really really weird and it kind of hurts me a little bit that it's still sitting on shelves and people don't really I guess care that much but a shoe that restocks like a 7210 or you know like the French blues are probably gonna restock again not to put those shoes down but they're gonna sell out immediately so it's it's kind of weird to me but Hey, it is what it is. Anyway, enough with the chit chat. I got the shoes here. Unfortunately, I did already unbox them a little bit, but let's just do it right now. I'll show you guys what we got inside. Hell yes, bitch. The Aqua 8s from 2015. Still confused as to why these didn't sell so well. Some people were talking about, oh, there's too much glitter on the midsole and this and that. And I understand some people uh, don't really like the eights in general. So that's totally fine. Um, but in terms of like the glitter thing, someone then made a video, I think it's MJL23 Dan Shots, you man, um, said it's actually closer to the OGs than the 07 pair was. I don't know, there's all this back and forth. It was kind of funny. Uh, to me, that doesn't bother me at all. Um, whether it's closer to the original or not, I still, it's all about this shoe itself. Um, I'm just so happy that I have it now. And uh, I understand, you know, if people don't really like the eights, on the other hand, um, I do have a couple pairs. I have the playoffs, the Bugs Bunnies, uh, the Phoenix Suns, and these, and these are by far my favorite, the best colorway in my opinion. Um, Jordan did wear these. Uh, during his NBA season uh, with the Bulls, of course. And uh, I don't know, this is just, like when I think the eight, I think this shoe, this colorway, and that's that. So I'm gonna leave it at that. Uh, let me know down below, did you guys end up grabbing this shoe? Did you have the last retro? Did you, you know, do you have the OGs maybe? Uh, let me know in the comments down below. Would love to know your thoughts. Uh, maybe you passed on these. I'd love to know that too. I'm gonna do he sign out. Peace.